it's another week and as you can see I've brought in my dreads for now they'll they're just a little tight because I just made them so it's a little pulling at my scalp but in the long run I'm gonna appreciate that because having two meters long dreads is just very messy <laughs> because they always fall all over me and they get caught in everything it's just it's just easier with dreads so I'm gonna keep them for like a week I suppose until I wash them again I suppose. Um, it's been um, a, ma a medium week. Could have been worse. It could have been better. <laughs> I didn't do much in the three first day, the two first day. Um, I had plans to do stuff, and I didn't do them. <laughs> I wanted to make the cane, I didn't do it. I wanted to make hot pot and I still didn't do it. Uh, maybe tomorrow? <laughs> I didn't do much. I didn't even went to the garden once. Um, I, I did the dishes once. I still have to finish the second time. And I did some cleanup of my place, which is good apparently saturday i did something called osh h s h and i have no idea what it is which is just great surprise surprise anyway <laughs> um Sunday and Monday I did my dreads and I crocheted all of the grey wool I have for Broken Dreams which was one kilogram of it and I realized as I was finishing it that I only have 21 dreads out of all everything and um, a good set will be more than that so I doubled it I ordered another kilo of of wool which means that already what the materials cost me is a hundred euros which is a pain in the ass so I'm gonna have to make it like 200 for for the price for the final price um, to be sold and I don't like it but I don't really have a choice so yeah Damn, that's annoying me. What was Ash Sage? Maybe I was reading something? So it was not something I read. Uh, <laughs> that's gonna torture me, uh, I think. I really want to know what it is. Suppose I won't know. Like, it sounds like I school something, but why yes? I can't, can't remember it. It's gonna be driving me crazy all night. <laughs> I feel like I'm so screwed. <sighs> um, yeah, so then became February and um, I did a little more in the second part of the week. It was something. So I finished, as I said, I finished graduating all of Broken Dream that I have and I finished braiding some yellow thread around the tailor, tailor accents and I like it, just took me, took me a while. I went to my dock and then I went to buy some tea because I need some, some bulk tea. Um, and I wanted to go to the sex shop but uh, the thing is, um, it did not happen because we have a street in my town that we always called the street of, of sex shops. And I went there thinking there will be at least one that can take my cookies. And I went and they were all gone. My town has shifted 
dramatically and I wasn't there. I don't I don't remember why, how, when those sex shops disappear. And and then I look around me all over the town and I, I was like it changed so much! It it was it used to be a dingy, crappy kind of place that I loved and, and now it's a vegan shop. That's sad. Anyway, um I did better one day and then and then and then Tuesday came and it, it was bad. <laughs> um Tuesday is writing day and for the first hours I procrastinated on it um, because I did some paperwork and I sent a corset and I wrote some recipes in my book so it's so it's so clean and then it really was writing day and I really had to write and I was still not writing because I was tired and I was in pain and I couldn't focus and that was very annoying but I did manage to to write something once one thick one small thick what one one thousand and seven hundred words which is not a lot in a whole day of writing it's really not a lot um, and it, it was like pulled down in the in the two last hours because I forced myself to do it and it was terrible it's not my best work I'm not super proud but it's done and it's off and people that have been seeing my work for a while know that it's good so I should listen to them a little more <laughs> um, speaking of which I did, a, a, um, I did a new friend this week someone who commented on my fix and, and commented again on my fix and was like crazy sending me whole paragraphs on my fix like some of them are half my fix long and that was oh so awesome and i love her and yeah it's really nice to to be seen and to have validation it's really unhealthy the way that i'm addicted to it already but yeah i have a new, I have a new friend and that's good because the breakup with my girlfriend with my ex is becoming way more messy than I had planned and she sent me stuff and I just want it over I just want closure and I feel like that's not gonna happen can you tell I'm tired? <laughs> I forgot the light uh, yeah uh, I want closure I want it done it's it's just it sucks bad yeah um that is out of my control sadly so then i finally managed to write something so wednesday i pulled myself together and i woke up early and i went to grocery shop and i sent my package for my corset and and I did my tea and candle candles day and it was very frustrating in a way that most of the things that I planned for uh, didn't work out. By that I mean that my scented oil uh, are scented. They are just not very strong. Like I can I can smell it. But I don't think it's going to be strong enough, like concentrated enough to perfume a candle, which is not ideal. And I don't know how to concentrate oil. I know how to concentrate some water ba based thing, but it's oil. So I cannot just ev evaporate the oil. That's, that's not working. And I don't know what to do uh, about it. I am running out of ideas, which is annoying and a little scary, but like I didn't invest uh, money in beeswax or in anything except for a few cups, but I'll survive. Because I knew that if I can't do the oils the way that I want it, I'm not gonna do the candles. 
I want to do it on my terms or not at all. So for now it's not working, so it's just... The candles I understand by, so that's fine. Um, I don't like it, but it's fine. And the second disappointment of the day was I spent a lot of time carving my first steps. And I designed my logo and I love it, uh, but... But... What I want to do with the stamp, what I want to stamp, it's too fine. It's just written too small. I cannot carve it. It's just not working. And that's bad. <laughs> that's really, really annoying. Because that means that all of the stamp material that I have is useless. And also means that yeah, I will have to print more stickers. And I hate it. Because it's not it's not good for the planet and it's expensive, it's way more expensive than just a stamp and it's not durable because if I have a stamp I only need one if I, uh, if I do stickers I have to print stickers every time that's a big downsize but I don't really have a choice um, so it's a disappointment which is great and then today, um, oh, I dried some fruits. Um, 27 years later, I'm finally liking pineapple. It's been a long way to go, <laughs> but I guess it just just had to find the right pineapple. Um, today, what I did was wash my hair dreads. And it doesn't seem like a lot to you, but it's a process. Uh, it's a long process because it's, it's taking hours to dry and usually some fall off and I have to reattach them, so it's a lot of work. So I did that. I also washed uh, three sets differently because it's a final wash before I package them and send them. So I wanted them to be really quickly clean. Um, I continued some fruit drying, so I'm working on it currently. I changed my sheets, I braided the things, uh, which it also takes a lot more time than you think. And I spent three hours playing cards with my best friend. <laughs> that is not a waste of time. I will, yeah, I really appreciate those time and I won't feel guilty about it. But yeah, that was three years, three, three hours of my day. And on my list there was also some, some dishes washing and I'm about halfway through. I wanted to make the hot pot again today, but it's a lot of work. And today I was just tired and I just wanted pasta and, and reading and not going to all the process for the hot pot so it didn't happen. Uh, so yeah. I still have laundry to do tonight and well tonight <laughs> it's gonna be today for you. And yeah, and the vlog, of course. It's uh, it's a work in progress. Saturday, um, Saturday next, I'm gonna go to the thrift shop. I did not go Saturday last year today, but I will go because I had a dream with my coat. By the way, I filmed my coat. I'm gonna make. I'm gonna film. <laughs> I'm gonna give you the video now because. I finally, uh, finally filmed it and I love it and it's so flushy and I don't think it's a real word but it's long and it's warm and I can't wear any area I can wear it anymore because it's too warm outside it's like I can almost go out in a, in a fucking shirt so it's not warm enough it's not cold enough that I can actually wear it which is annoying because I didn't wear something warm for all of the time that it was actually cold and now that I have something warm to protect me 
it's warm. It's shit. So I have a dream with it and cur during the process of the dream the coat shifted to another kind of coat and it looked badass and I want to do it. I want to do it now. <laughs> so yeah. I want it. I want to make it. So I'm gonna thrift shop to Saturday and I'm trying to find the fabric for it. I hope. Tomorrow I'm gonna do the hot pot because I really need to do it because otherwise my purchase is to the wilt. Um, one of the priority priorities for next week will be to make the pockets for the dreads, which I did not do last week because I, I, I was a coward and I checked it out. And I did not because the last time I tried to serve it and all which for the coat didn't happen it didn't end well like at all and I don't know where are the instructions for my sewing machine since I bought it so long ago and I just I just don't know to use my my button or foot sewing foot I looked at on internet on YouTube but each time it was a different model of of foot and it was not the same as mine uh, so I'm still swimming in the unknown but I really need to do it I really need to do it because just um, I'm gonna have some clean dreads right um, like tomorrow once they're dry and I need to store them in their definitive storage right away if possible so I cannot just put them back in the dirty thing place they were from so I need it done it's a priority another priority is I have 24 bullet journal, bullet journal month to edit for all February because I want to make the year a video in February so I need to start working on it because because I have 24 to go so during the three days that I will be off specific thing next week I need to do them I need to at least do three to five it would be good to make four than more than three but we'll see how it goes um yeah I wanted to do the cane but it's gonna be complicated and complicated enough that I procrastinate on it so it's not a priority either. It would be good to make some red bubble designs because I still didn't do them. Um, and also I have an issue that I don't like. I have ordered something on a website that I have that I had a very hold account on and that means that when they used my address they used my very old address the place I was living when I was a kid so my childhood home and um, I didn't check silly me and I couldn't by the time I realized it was sent in the wrong address uh, they were all sent the four of them and so I was like my my name is not on the box anymore so it's not gonna be delivered right it's gonna be backed up to to the seller and it did not happen uh, the the main man just delivered them and I certainly hope it delivered them to the childhood home and not to the place my parents live now like please tell me so I will have I will wait until all four packages are there and I will go to the, my childhood home and beg for them and if that doesn't work in, in before that I will try to call the what do you say Mayo place 
um, but my York place to have the name of uh, the name and the number of the people who live there because I don't have their number so I, get, I don't I can call them to just check and I can find the number because I don't know their name so it's very annoying so I'm gonna call that place to get that number hopefully I'm gonna have it and then I'm gonna go back to my shadow home which I do not look forward to so yes what could be good to do would be to go to the garden to make the scripts for my young adult videos and to make March designs for the bullet journal but that's not a priority and I'm only I only have three days so that's unlikely but it's it's on list um, the thing is I didn't manage to to have a sex shop owner to talk to and I don't there is only one sex shop left in my town that is not a big corporation if I go into a big corporation and ask someone who has to follow the guidelines of the big corporations I know I'm never gonna give them my cookies that's never gonna happen so there is only one that is not and I don't I really don't feel like the effort is worth it because even if I go there they would probably say no so what I did was find another option another solution what I will do is I'll make the cookies on the 12th or 13th probably more the 12th and um, yeah I'm gonna make on the 12th and I'm gonna send them with me I'm gonna take the weighted blanket and the cookies and go back to my friends to my friends a turnover and and I'm gonna give them cookies and I'm gonna give, eat them with her and um, and we're gonna make a, um, a duct tape dummy so I can make my own dress form out of it which would be great because if I want a fitted coat and I want to make it I will need <laughs> actually uh, to make to have a fitted dress form so yeah that would be nice I'm looking forward to it actually so yeah that's good news it's gonna take a little, a little more work and that means that I will have a lot less time free to do what I'm supposed to do but it's gonna be fun and I don't regret proposing it so yeah I'm looking forward to this what else didn't I do? didn't say um, yeah about, about sugar the thing is I saw my dog uh, one day and it did not go well the annoying little piece of shit that he was first refused to give me a double dose for my skin disease medicament medicine and uh, was very pissed because I've been under that double dose for years and I was fine but he was like, no, um, if, if you have a problem I do on your liver or on your, or on your kidneys but for, because of it and it's like, no, <laughs> you have it, it's, it's on me, it's, it's my responsibility and I'm like, I've been under double dose for five years, I took a hundred of them one night when I tried to kill myself and it did not work, I'm not gonna die from it just give me the double dose so I can be comfortable in my skin like it's very annoying I I know that I'm sick I know that I'm gonna die in the next 10 years max tops I'm never gonna make it to 70 I don't care about the long term problems that will cost that will be because of that med if I take it too much I'm not even asking it to be constantly under the double dose. I only did it, need it for one, for
for once in a while to have the double dose to be comfortable. I'm not asking him to keep me alive until I was 80. I'm not asking him to make me a cent century old person. I don't know how you say it in English. I just asking him to make the last years of my life as comfortable as humanly possible as even as sick as I am so I'm really pissed at him and he also scoffed at me and was like yeah quitting sugar what you're doing is, is useless especially if you plan on starting again uh, just start to l try to lower and he was like yeah try some aspartame uh, just have the the sugar test and uh, eat some whole wheat low sugar cookies and I was like no no I don't want my life to be about aspartame and low sugar cookies it's not a cookie if it, there is there's not sugar in it I will take aspartame for my tea because I'm taking a lot of sugar usually so aspartame is better I don't want to live my life without sugar it's one of the few things that actually bring me joy if I can't have cookies, real cookies and not this weird wheel, 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 wheat, wheel wheat cookies that are just bad I don't want to leave it I, I, I admit I really don't want to leave it but that's not the point if I'm, if I'm doing this, if I'm quitting sugar the point was to get rid of the of the addiction and so I can have a start over from fresh without the, the need for, of sugar but we still have the pleasure of it if it's not gonna work I'm gonna start taking sugar again I don't see the point of making myself miserable because right now I am miserable I just want cookies and brownies and pies ah, come on I want cake if I can have it because I'm quitting sugar and if quitting sugar it's not working it's useless I'm just gonna get my cake so yeah it didn't it didn't went well so I'm probably gonna take those cookies and eat them but I will not be able to eat them all because I'm, I'm planning on making a lot of them so I'm gonna bring them to my friend and we're gonna eat them together while making myself a, a duct tape dummy and probably watch something funny because it's what you do with a friend I suppose we're gonna have some good time there are, there are some of my designs that I will not be able to eat I just, I, I'm gonna read what is on it and I'm gonna be like no I can't, I can't take it <laughs> I really can't eat that, that's just too dirty and that's good because I think that's not gonna stop her <laughs> I think she's gonna like them and just eat them I love her, she's amazing <laughs> that's why she's my friend yeah so that's the plan for next week and I feel like February is gonna be only four weeks it's gonna be so short and I'm never gonna f do everything all of my all of my planning all of my goals and I remember the, the week that worked out was because I didn't plan that much I had a few big things to do and it worked out because I didn't fix myself s such goals that I knew I couldn't do them and lately well my list of to-do list is just too big I, c I cannot handle all of that so of course I know I can't so I don't even try and I should have a super shorter to-do list so it's more likely to happen that's a problem because I still have a lot of things to do so I need to find the right balance between the two and that's that's complicated that's uh, very complicated but we're gonna figure something out tomorrow tomorrow I put and pockets and the day after that the maus and for the rest we'll see yeah see ya
feel so warm. But my legs are hurting. 